right, today I continue detailing uh, the buffalo. I'll be working on the eyes a little bit. I like the texture I came up with yesterday for the fur. And I'll fine tune that even at some point. Time to play with some clay. There's a little fold of skin that goes right over the top of the eye, right there. And kind of disappears into the uh, rest of the uh, area. this feature here too that uh, under the eye one way I keep myself in the studio and I can buy clay to work with and pay for the internet to put the uh, videos that I shoot on to the web is through my sales of my uh, instructional videos um, if you're so inclined, uh, check the link below this video uh, where I have a review of all nine of my current instructional videos and uh, see if you possibly find anything interesting there. Um, I pretty much give you my over 50 years of experience in sculpting and uh, I'd really appreciate it if you'd uh, consider purchasing one or two or even all of my videos. Um, they're streaming online on Vimo and uh, you need a passcode to see them. But that works forever as long as you have that passcode and the link. So please uh, consider that and let's get busy on sculpting now. End of promotion. Now this looks kind of odd, but that's the way. That's the form. That's the form. That's the form of the uh, fur on the nose. It. Uh, I'm thinking it comes from them in deep grass. It, it just wears the fur away near the nose.
all I'm going to be doing on this side right now is just adding little globs of clay to simulate fur. Finally getting some of the old clay covered. I'm just putting the final little touches of texture on the uh, fur that's hanging loose and down over his forehead. If he was running, this fur would be, would be pushed back by the wind. I'm putting very little detail in the fur. I'm thinking of the uh, patina that I will put on this and uh, I'm thinking of a uh, bronze patina that uh, would be browns and uh, the uh, bra brass, brass part of the bronze showing through the uh, patina, a very rich patina and I think that this uh, texturing would lend itself to that a lot I've got a lot of work to do on smoothing out some of these uh, crevices on the uh, face, but that's part of detailing. It just takes time. That's going to be it for today. I'll come back. Uh, tomorrow and uh, see how far I get now tomorrow is going to be the last day that I'll be here in the uh, building and uh, I'll be back in my studio next week hopefully it's been fun but I prefer my studio <laughs> a little more quiet I can try and concentrate better there all right, everybody, have a great night, and I'll see you next time. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. It really would help me. Also, check out the link below this video. It will take you to a review of my nine instructional videos. 
that could be very helpful to you if you're thinking of sculpting. Good night, everybody.